Hey guys, welcome to PsyQ. If you were like me, you were so excited to see climate change finally mentioned in a Republican debate and then absolutely devastated when Marco Rubio totally ruined the answer. He said that protecting the environment would ruin the American economy and that a cap and trade system was something that he would never even consider if he were president. But the thing is, he was relying on the fact that most Americans don't really understand what a cap and trade system is. It's just putting a cap or a maximum on the amount of carbon that we can release as a nation. So if you want to go over that amount, you have to do something to offset the carbon. If you want to release an extra gigaton of carbon over the amount that we've set as the cap, you have to plant enough trees to absorb one gigaton of carbon dioxide. So it basically requires the biggest polluters, oil companies, coal companies, the ones making all the profits, to invest back into the economy and has been shown to actually strengthen the economy in many of the countries where it's been implemented. Now, if you want to make America great again, it's one of the best ways going. It's been so popular around the world. My country, Australia, was one of the first to implement a cap and trade system. And since then, they've been implemented across Europe, 27 countries. They're used in Japan, Korea, Thailand. China has not one, but seven cap and trade systems. They're used in Brazil, New Zealand, and even some parts of America. California has just implemented one. And what Marco Rubio probably also didn't realize is that a cap and trade system is being used nationwide, not for carbon dioxide, but for sulfur dioxide, one of the main components in acid rain. When we realized that companies were releasing too much sulfur dioxide into the atmosphere, we implemented a cap and trade system to bring that amount down. Now, not only did it not ruin the economy in any way, but it also was extremely effective at reducing the amount of acid rain that we see. So Marco Rubio, I'm not saying that a cap and trade system is the only solution, but it's definitely a solution that you need to consider because if you don't do anything to stop climate change, you won't just ruin the environment. You'll also ruin the future economy for millions of Americans. Hi everyone, I'm Jade Lovell, resident science nerd on the Young Turks Network. You're watching PsyQ and we know you don't want to miss an episode, so please click the subscribe button down below.